Pendant la semaine au 22 au 26 février, le lycée de Milo West a été rempli de stands à Theme Point Coincidere avec la semaine nationale française. During the week of February 22nd through the 26th, Millard West High School was full of French-themed displays to coincide with National French Week. With showcases for different foods in French-speaking countries, a lot of time and effort was put in. French teacher Sarah Karst, the organizer of the event, explains where she got the idea from. When I was student teaching, the, my cooperating teacher um, did it at that school and it was a big hit. Everyone loved it. It got the students really excited and involved and staff got involved and it, everyone knew it was, it was French week. It was going to be wild. Along with French delicacies by the foods room, there were idioms with literal interpretations in one English hall and poppies in another. So this year we decided to do the poppies. Um, I'd say that we had some different projects this year and were able to incorporate some new ideas while still kind of keeping the same feel of National French Week in previous years. One unique aspect of French Week is the Francophone Countries, an exhibition of various French-speaking nations. The pays les comment le Canada et la Guyane Française sont plus connus tandis que le Maroc et le Cameroon pourront se prendre sultan. We had to come up with different francophone countries and then from there we had to think about different stuff we wanted to look into for each country and then we had to go and find all of that information which for some of them took a little bit of an extensive search to try and find and then from there we had to copy it onto poster paper. Along with foods in French speaking countries, the popular lock bridge appeared by the second level teacher plan area. Students would be given a paper lock and write down something to motivate them and others around them. They would then cut a slip off the lock and tape it back over the railing. The lock bridge is actually usually a romantic thing. Lovers put their names on the locks or like put it on the bridge together and then lock it and throw the key in the scent to kind of represent that their love can't be undone and it's eternal. Um, so it's a big tourist attraction for sure. Not only did people in the French club help, but so did students in French class. I definitely liked being able to put together all the different activities that we put around the school, getting to do all the different art projects, and learning just a little more about French. Even though we are in French, you still get to learn a couple new things. But the overall entire goal of French Week is to promote French-related classes and activities and to get more students into the French community. This has been Jordan Bacar and Logan Mosley with the MWHS Wildcat News.